Welcome back to the Wealth Principle Secret Video Series. You're watching secret video number four. So what is the fourth secret to financial prosperity? Well, you need to know how to build your empire from the ground up with the right business structure. Basic knowledge of wealth protection is essential to your survival. Is your goal to change your lifestyle completely from an employee mentality to an entrepreneurial mentality? Then you need to understand how to best protect yourself. To start, independent business ownership is what every big thinking entrepreneur should be striving for. You don't need to be a lawyer or a chartered accountant to fully understand wealth protection, but you do need to know the basics. Hire the right people and professionals who can structure your business for true success. You need to understand that just because you incorporate a company does not mean that all your assets, including your personal assets, will be protected. Incorporation does not give you anonymity or 100% liability protection. That is a myth you need to understand. Too many times I have heard and read that you must incorporate to protect yourself in the process as a side benefit. You will get access to the best tax saving strategies. I have personally realized that these things aren't true. This is true about tax savings benefits, but not about wealth protection. Governments are constantly changing and addressing how companies and individuals can use the tax and legal system. If you are unaware, there can be many pitfalls. There are three significant issues starting out that you need to be aware of. First, avoid any personal debt liabilities. Don't go into debt with personal uh, things. Only use debt corporately from both a taxation and liability perspective. Second, know what a personal service business designation is. And third, know the difference between what a corporation, partnership, and proprietorship are. Learn how they apply to any type of business. To start, only shareholders who are not employed by the business are granted 100% liability protection under the law. So it is imperative that you start out with the right business structure and understand the consequences. When you are the president, CEO, secretary, and chief bottle washer, you are at risk, incorporated or not. A personal service designation can have tax ramifications. You want to avoid being labeled with this distinction. It may cause you to be taxed at a higher rate simply Put any business with a five or less employees can be considered a personal service business and this is recognized in both Canada and the United States. If you manage or list or is listed as a director or an officer of the company, you are at risk. The key to protection is to create separation between you and as much of the day-to-day -day business activity as possible. Now in the beginning this may seem unwarranted, it might be a little difficult because you probably are doing a lot of most of the work in your company, especially if you do have less than five employees. But setting up the right structure early will save you time and money. The best system for protection is what I call a three-tier business structure. Whether you are building a real estate empire or opening up a simple mom and pop pizza shop, you need to know how to best protect the empire you are creating. Essentially, I'm talking about creating a holding company that in turn will own other companies. The best example I can give you is Warren Buffett's Berkshire Hathaway. When building your empire from the ground up, be sure to use a holding company structure. There are both tax and liability benefits to this type of structure if used properly. Always use a lawyer or a chartered accountant to make sure that it's done correctly. Continue reading the fourth chapter to learn more about it, creating wealth protection early on, even when you don't seem to have anything to protect in the beginning, is the fourth secret to financial prosperity and, and should never be ignored. Keep reading and I will see you in about 17 pages or so. Hopefully you're reading the book in order. It is important. My name is Greg Luchak, if you haven't figured that out already, and you have a great day.